Hey guys, well, I wanted to do another video today. I'm on a roll. I had some ideas over the weekend to put out some new material for you guys. And so what I wanted to highlight today was um, just two channels. Um, the other channel, if you haven't seen the videos from earlier today, I covered uh, Shield of the Sun's video over gang stalking. So if you haven't seen that video, you definitely need to check that out and subscribe to his channel. But I also wanted to do another um, channel, which as you're seeing on the screen, it's Nappy Head Roots. And I really, really like his channel um, just for a variance of different reasons. Um, you know, what I like and admire about him is that he actually has no problem addressing the gang stalkers and asking them questions when he can. And so this video documents him actually going up to a perpetrator um, that is forthcoming with the perks of, you know, what you get when you're a, a um, person that is a perpetrator. And also, you know, how they approach you. So anyway, I want you guys to check this video out. I'll put his um, channel information in, in the description box below. And um, anyway, here we go. <laughs> Who said if I knew I was going to be recorded? I would never have yeah. even thought that you were recording me. That's pretty fucked up, though, man. Yeah. I mean, it's basically like highway patrol, except it's street. They're just on the streets, and they don't have cars. That's the only difference. And, so, and, they, and they don't have to have a license. You don't. And as long as you don't have any felonies or anything like that, you can work for them. No, there's gang stalkers with felonies, aren't there? I don't think so. I never heard of any. I mean, there's probably some with that used to be on parole that just got their record expunged. How long did you, how long did it take for you to be in a program before they asked you if you wanted to be a part of it? Six months. Oh, you have to be six months in a program? Yeah, because they want you to be in your right mind, I guess. They don't want you to be drinking or uh, doing drugs on the job or anything like that. Well, I see a lot of gang stalkers on drugs. Most of my gang stalkers are Well, most of them don't even... Their bosses don't even know they're on drugs. They keep it low, low key. Yeah, and they don't drug test you. So you're positively sure that it's the city of San Jose that pays you? Yeah. Looks like a new thing, so my, I may, it might become the whole city of Santa Clara soon, but right now it's just San yeah. Jose. The whole city, shit, that's fucking I mean, in control like a motherfucker. Imagine if it was the whole county, you wouldn't even be able to go to Gilroy, let's say, without being harassed or whatever. Uh, you know a lot of them? Uh, just a couple. Fuck, man. Most of them already have their own place right now, like Section A or Housing 1000. They give like a lot that. of them housing, huh? Yeah, and they give you, like, they pay you in... Most of them get paid in gift cards for like the first month. So you fuck with people for gift cards. You know, these people Basically. fuck with people for and gift cards. And they're not just like $10 gift cards. They're $100 gift cards from like Target, Ross, uh, like uh, Safeway. That's why everybody... That way you can get clothes and eat, you know? That's why I know. Everybody so. wants to be on that shit, not just because they can fuck with people, but because, you know, they, they can go shopping and eat whatever they want, at wherever they want, you know? That's right. But you guys know you that when you do that shit, you're putting your life on the line. Yeah, I, see, you, I see, you get a lot of death threats from that. I know that much. I know. I, I see a lot of fucking people, bro. They got their kids involved in this shit. What? Like, they be walking up and down the street fucking with people with their kids in the stroller or with their little dogs and shit. These are like the rich people. Right? Uh, like, the neighborhood watching people and shit. They, they... Those are probably like the handlers. Those are the people that trickle the money down to you guys, yeah. probably. Well, those are the main ones that really give extra money to the to ta tax 
uh, the ta tax holders so that those kind of people could be employed. It's basically like you're being employed by the mayor. Hypothetically. What What is it for? Like just to run all the people out or what? No, just to keep the peace. Keep the peace? How are you keeping peace when you're going around <laughs> fucking with people making them think that they're crazy, man? How is that keeping the peace? I don't know. Don't ask me. I'm not on it. I just know about it because I went to go check it out. So, mainly all the homeless people are up under that shit. But, see, they don't fuck with them that as much as the San Jose City Police do. No, but because, well, the police are in the background. Well, they yeah, have to but be, because you know, like this, police the will stuff, fuck with you for anything. Yeah, but that's they can't. why they're under investigation. That's why the sheriffs are doing the main, uh, uh, that's why the sheriffs are doing the main crime sprees and everything, and they got other covers now. Because, before they had that, uh, uh, but this gang stalker shit isn't a race thing. It's you guys are fucking with everybody. Well, they're fucking with everybody. I mean, this, I don't know. I, I mean, honestly, you don't want to get in trouble, I understand. But I'm yeah. just saying, like, damn, man, that's fucked up, bro. A lot of people dying out here behind that shit, like killing themselves. You, you know about that, right? Like the dude that jumped off the top of the uh, Night Rider building? That motel, or hotel, the Night Rider? I it was a tree. No, he jumped off the, it's three people. Somebody jumped off the tree. Somebody jumped off that high rise building. And then somebody jumped off the parking garage. Behind this shit, man. Damn, I didn't know that. Yeah. I know. Yeah. I knew yeah, somebody. Of they're not I gonna knew let somebody me. jump off a tree, but I thought that was Thanks. just plain suicide. Yeah, man. I, I, I mean, that's one of the reasons why I don't want to be on the bank. They don't tell you that. They just tell y'all to fuck with people and try and keep the peace. Yeah, they don't tell you the whole whole story because then they know you're not gonna work work for it because they, you know you got the risk of being threatened. Yeah, I mean, it's not like the mafia, but it's really hard. Because you have to sign, it's, you have to sign a paper that says they're not liable for any, uh, any damages or anything that might happen, like those suicides that were happening. Like, those people. Oh, so you didn't know people, about the suicides behind it? I didn't know about the suicides behind it, but I did know that the people that were uh, provoking those people to do it, the ones on the patrol thing, uh, they had signed a contract saying that they're uh, basically their bosses have, no, have nothing to do with that. Basically, so if they get in trouble for doing it, they get in trouble. Yes, not their bosses, not the whole patrol thing. Basically, they get taken to court, not the other people. So it's like the other people had nothing to do with it, just them. So that's that's why. But see, that their is, their impression behind scary, the whole thing was that they were signing the, signing the contract for like uh, their own physical damages that might happen, like maybe like accidents, like like getting hit by a car or something, or like you know having a heart attack. That that was their impression because the contract wasn't was never specific. It was just all under fine print. You don't read by print. Why are you telling me this? Because I'm not honest, so I got nothing. I don't. I don't. I'm, I mean, if I was honest, I wouldn't be telling you this. But how? I mean, how? 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 How do you know this information if you're not on it? I went to check it out. Oh, you went through the classes and shit. No, I just, I just went to the. Uh, it, it was sort of like a seminar. Where do you? Where do you? And then I left. Where do you? Where was the seminar? City Hall. City Hall? What? I told you it's coming out of our, our so tax all, So all, the, politi all yes. the politicians are behind this yes, shit? Yes, all the fucking politicians are behind it. That's why I didn't get to work on it. I'm like, fuck it. Man, the politicians are behind these motherfuckers fucking with me, man. That's crazy. Hey, man, I just want to let you know I appreciate everything, bro. Yeah. You
gave me a lot of information that, you feel me, motherfuckers been trying to hide from me for a long time, bro. And uh, shit, man, if I could pay you, man, if you need something, man, let me know, man. These gang stalkers is fucking with me. They're fucking with other people. The only thing that would help is a petition to stop this bullshit. If well, every homeless person, even every, you know, non-homeless person that had, was tired of this shit sign a petition, that nobody, this whole city patrol thing wouldn't even be on, in existence. Can you do me a favor? Yeah. Hey, you guys, this is like a, a hero right here. I wouldn't go too far with it, but this guy's a hero. Um, you know, they offered him a job, the gang stalkers, which you guys have heard it comes from uh, City Hall. Where all the politicians and inbred motherfuckers are. Um, yeah, man, this guy right here, he gave me a lot of information. Uh, gave us a lot of information that's targeted individuals. Uh, you want to state your name? Anthony Coleman. You can call me Tony or T for short. Anthony Coleman or Tony or T for short. Appreciate everything. You want to tell the gang stalkers anything? You gang stalkers, stop the bullshit and. Quit while you can because your life is in danger. I guarantee it. If it's not now, it will be in a couple of weeks. All right. Thanks a lot, bro. Yes. There you have it, guys. There you have it. So go on and subscribe to Nappy Head Roots. Again, I'll put all the information down in the description box below. And I hope this helped everybody. Later.